Hmm, is that guy dead? Oh, well, I mean, obviously, but is he is he the correct level of dead? We not have a new word for this. Oh, he has pooed himself, though. Hmm. Well, maybe it's for the best he stays dead, you know? Guess this is the media room. Man, the way Claire's, like, looking around and sort of being generally spooked is fantastic. Kind of makes me sad that Resi 7 wasn't third person, actually. Oh, dude. I'm gonna need whatever this is. Sweet. Huh, oh, he didn't get up. Uh, is there anything else in here that's of value? I can turn the light on, which is great. I can't see anything else shining. Now the light's on, I'm allowed. Maybe I can. I don't know, molest the desk or something? No? Alright, Claire, fuck it. Making use of the map. Okay. Well, I know what a map is. Uh, so we're in the press room. Oh, sweet. Uh, what room was locked off? Here? This room here, I guess? There's a bathroom. The watchman's room is on kind of yellowy, so I guess we should aim towards that then. The holding thing makes me worry there may be suspiciously evil quick time events. Hello? Well, we are a lady. Let's go into the ladies' toilets. Ah, this is where all the flooding came from, I guess. Did anyone die on the toilet? If you died on the toilet, tell me now so I won't embarrass you. I mean, you might be dead, but you still got some dignity, right? Ooh. First aid spray. Thank you very much. Well, no one took a dump in it. Aha! What do you reckon, Claire? Any keys in there? Well, first aid spray is a good find. Well, that guy clearly. Oh, oh my god! What is it? The smell? Is it the fact that the walls are painted in this really boring blue that you know just sort of makes you scream, "God, I'm so sleepy"? Well, there's nothing else, is it? Let's be honest. I guess I need bolt cutters. Open up! Hurry! Open up! There's a man asking me to open the door. Oh, uh, which which door? Sorry, you have to be more specific. There's like four. So he, he's not specific. We can take our time. Uh, that's locked. Hello, Mr. Grumpy. Sounds like he's being chased by something or something. Hmm. I'm here. Open the door. Hurry up. Hurry up. Open it. Yeah, sure. There's no rush. Oh, what's that? Do I need that? No, no, you'd be fine, dude. Suck it up. Maybe he's got a really bad stomachache. Uh, he does. He's got really bad stomachache. Like, half of it's missing. I'm so sorry. If only I'd been quicker. Oh, sweet. Officer's notebook. Goddess statue. Three emblems. Three medallions, question mark. Parking garage, question mark. Thing. I guess that's a clue for what I need. What is that, a Metroid? Circle thing? Big thing, Metroid. Right. Let's look for a Metroid. Oh, that's kind of handy. Lion, drugs, eagle. Fish, scorpion, urn. Girly, bow, snake. See? Easy. I mean, Metroid, close enough. Dear. Oh dear. Sir? Hey. Alright. Ah, shit. 
All right, I'm gonna peace out of here. Friggin' zombies, man. Oh, Jesus. All right, let's just leg it. See you later, guys. Oh, shit. Uh, I kind of need to go that way. I don't have an awful lot of ammo. What are the chances you guys are going to be cool about this? Oh, shit. All right. Is he dead? Now he's dead. Alright, sweet. Let's go. And that guy got bored. He ain't following me. Ooh. Oh, sweet. Planks of wood. That was totally worth shooting all those dudes. Oh, ammo. That was totally worth shooting all those dudes. Ah. Oh, friggin' A. Alright, nice. Pardon me, madam. Pardon me, sir. Pardon me, other sir. Neat. Time to me to compulsively reload and get the hell out of here. Remember, Claire, people die by getting stuck under these things. Ooh, good gracious. Hey! Where do you even come from? That's a scam. Claire, kick him in the face. Oh, see, that's what could have happened to you, Claire. You all right? Yeah. You're safe. For now. Well... That looks like a very meaty wound you got there, dude. Hey, Marv. Thanks. Obviously, someone taught you well. What? How to yeah. introduce myself? Yeah. I know how to take care of myself. My name's Thanks, by the way. <clears throat> really? You, you got the guy with the friggin' half a stomach missing to pull you up? Come on, Claire. Come on, Claire. Don't don't be like that. So nobody knows what caused this. There's a lot of theories, but all I know for sure is that this place is crawling with zombies. Yeah, you're telling me. Hey, hey, keep that on, just in case. I'm not gonna be around long. Once I find Chris, we're out of here. You're really Chris's sister? Yeah. Why? Did you find something? He's on vacation. Europe, I think. Left weeks ago. Vacation? What? That's, that's great news. Well, I've got more for you. Looks like there might be a way out through this secret passageway. Good. <gasps> hey. Uh, hey, we should probably get you to the hospital. Oh, no, no. Forget about me. I can take care of myself. No. Don't be ridiculous. You're going to need some help. Listen, Claire. Save yourself. So you can see your brother again. In Europe. You know, Spain maybe. You probably need this. No, I'm not taking that. You're gonna. Shh. And be careful. If you see one of those things, no matter who they were, you can't hesitate. Take them out if you can, or you run. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Marv is having a bad day. Appreciate the knife, though, dude. Sweet. Combat knife. This knife wears down with use and will break. Bummer. Can we use the counterattack? Well, that's useful. I guess not to waste it is probably the key. You know, like I did in the demo. <laughs> I love it gets you to test the, the whole... Ready sub-weapon attack. Space bar and... Hey, dude. Ah, see. You don't need to pull out a gun around, Marv. Sorry, Marv. Alright, well, because Claire doesn't have any thumbs, let's use the uh, knife to cut through this uh, yellow tape. Beep. Neat. Right, while that shutter is uh, doing its best to open in a dramatic fashion, let's look the op opposite way and quickly save it, shall we? So what does she say? Uh, just, no, I guess it just tells us what's going on. Eh, find three medallions. Neat. Come on, Claire. Let's squeak over this way. Ooh, let's... Ah, no, no, no. Let's not combine them yet. Until I'm full on goodies. Ooh, isn't there a, uh... I know. Hold on. 
There is a magical box in here that we can use, isn't there? So let's deluxe weapons added. Oh, cool. Uh, what do you reckon, guys? We can use the Samurai Edge, the Jill's, Chris, or Wesker's models if you want me to. Or I'll stick with the regular handgun. It's your call, I don't mind. If you think it'd be too much and might make it, like, might break the sequence of getting stuff in the game, I'll leave them. I'm, I'm not fussy. Right, let's store that. Uh, let's store one of these, actually, just in case. Uh, do we want to store anything else? A well-worn key. Do, do I need that for now? I don't know what the tick box means, whether I've... Whether I've... It's used its... Can you... It's got a tick box, maybe that means it's it's done? I don't know. Anyway. Let's move on. This place is surprisingly well lit for an apocalypse, you know? It's nice. Oh, well, scratch that. Spooky. I'm always impressed they managed to barricade in the most Tetris fashion possible. Look at that. I would never be able to get a barricade that efficiently. It's probably why I'd die, you know? Ooh. Yeah. Uh, ew, he's, uh, man, his dental hygiene is terrible. Oh, God, someone get that guy to the dentist. Who's there? A spooky barrel. Can I, can I take any of his, oh, no. <gasps> Ew. Ooh, his head split like a melon. Hey, it's Marv. Hey, Marv. He's Officer of the Month. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so we found two different types of keys. Hmm. That looks like a, a zombie hole. So I guess I can use the boards to make it less of a zombie hole. Neat. Alright, well. That works. Madam? Madam, I've just had those windows cleaned if you could not smear blood all over them. Oh, honestly, I don't know why I bothered. Aw, oh, I was kind of hoping we could just knock on the window and annoy her. No. Oh, well. Honestly. There's just no need for that kind of behavior. So, Madam, I'm going to have to shoot you in the face. It's important. I guess I could test out the knife, but since the knife has, like, limited, uh... Oh no? Wait, oh no, she's she's dead? Or oh no, she's not dead? Man, how do I test if a zombie's still- Ah, shit! <laughs> I need that back, by the way, so I'm going to have to shoot you now. You bastard. No, no, Claire. That's a bitch. That's a lady zombie. Can I, can I have my knife back now? Man, lady, you suck. She's kind of jiggling. I think she's dead though, she basically has no nose. And um, we all know that zombies with no noses can't smell their prey. Hmm. Is there a light switch in here? Record of events. September the 25th. We're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority, as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. September 25th, addendum. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this was simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. What? Killing someone? Alright, dude. September 26th, a mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we are, it'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure how we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September the 27th. There was another clash on the west side of the station around 1pm. 12 people died. There's only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray here. 
from David. Well, David, you'll be pleased to know it's gone completely to tits. Ew. A map. Thank you. Wait. Is this a map of the first floor or the ground floor? Or is this an American first floor and this is the ground floor? I think this is the ground floor, right? Okay, as long as we're clear. Cool. Right. Uh, so I can climb out of here if I want to, but I kind of want to look around. Ah, see? There is ammunition. And door. So let's check. Let's get this ammunition first. Combine. Okay, good. I'm glad I can combine lots of ammo into one place, because that's kind of useful. And this door has the horrible dead, blo dead bolts of doom. She's still dead. Glorious. This is barricaded. Right, so I'm going to have to go through the window then. Let's have a quick nosy out of the window. Whoop. Careful, Claire, there is broken glass. That's, that's, that's how you cut yourself. Uh, this guy's probably dead. Yeah, he's probably dead. Oh, no. Uh, sweet. Thanks, dude. So, dead, dead bodies are worth checking just in case they have something under them, I guess. If he doesn't notice me, I guess I can sneak past him. Oh. Well, so much for that, I guess. No, no, no. This one's about... Okay. Like, Claire, we're going to have to have a discussion on how we correctly insult our adversaries, alright? What the fuck? Now, that's better. What the fuck, indeed. Hey! Here's a little high five. High five, dude. Good for you. You're a good zombie. Alright, nice. Alright. This is just an office next to the records room. Can we get in here? No. It's locked. Or as they say in other places, jammed. Uh, so there's a safety deposit room and another office. Which we should look into. Uh... Storage locker terminal memo. It appears that the keypad to the locker terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest that the person responsible for this mess find some spare keys and Zelda Green and fix this right now. You know who you are, bastard. Who else would fuck it up so badly? Man, that's not even a passive-aggressive memo. That's just an aggressive memo. Okay, so this place has cool swag for which I need to get locker keys for. That's fine. Uh. Hey, dude. Hey. Man, that was gory. Hey, you were dead. Stop being a jerk and stay dead this time. I mean, he wasn't even dead. He was like double dead. What an asshole. Hmm. Where's that go? To the dark room. I'm gonna go check out West. Keep that thought, dude. Seriously? Seriously? Hmm. Guess Claire's not hungry. Alright, well. Where's West office? It was... Shit. Here, wasn't it? <laughs> Gunpowder. Okay, gunpowder... Combine two of these to make handgun ammo. Nice. What the hell is up with him? What do you mean what the hell's up with him? Come on, Claire, he's dead. Well, not dead enough for my liking, but you know, that's the problem. Cool. Use of the gunpowder. Make ammo. Make high quality ammo. Make high high quality submachine gun ammo. There's not a lot of ammo left around the station, so make use of any gunpowder you find. Cool. Will do. And by that I mean I'll just randomly shoot zombies. Beep beep. Oh look, they were welcoming Leon for a little party, isn't that nice? Rookie's first assignment. Leon S. Kennedy, we're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Input the letters in input the letters in the order of our desks. There are two locks, one on each side of your desks. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names, but you figure that out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Scrawled in the corner and drop between drops of bud. 
Be glad you're not here, rookie. Oh man, that's unlucky. Okay, so we need we need to find out all the we need to get like a uh, list of the officers' names so we can get that key. Operation report. It's down to me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel under this place left over from his museum days. I brushed our idea off, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof there's even a tunnel, or that the zombies aren't infested- The sewers aren't infested with zombies. No, not the zombie infest- Not sewer infested zombies. Ah! <clears throat> but I don't want to sit here and want it wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try and find out what I can about that tunnel. Okay, so we can actually find out their names anyway. David. Elliot. Um, Neil. Uh, we're missing one here. Unless it's on the floor. Oh, maybe I can see on his badge? Ah, shit, I can't read it. It's too small. Uh, Rita. Marvin. So we're missing someone. David? Are we David Ford? Have we, have we missed or have we got him? No, we already got David. Okay, so... Okay, so we've got a... It's from left to right, so that's fine. So... Oh, is it down? Ah, right. It's... So this would be D for David. Okay, so let's have a quick look. So we've got David. we got uh, Elliot. So D, E, and... I should have really paid attention the first time around. D, E, and N. So N, E, D. So Ned on this side. So Ned on that side, cool. And then on this side we've got Marvin, Rita, and a mysterious one. So uh, we can by process of elimination we can find out. So Marvin and Rita. So Rita's the middle one. Marvin's the last one. No, okay. Marvin's this side. Oops. There we go. Speed loader. Nice. How does this work? A custom part. So, do I com health and recovery items? Yeah, fine. How do I combine stuff then? Combine with the. We now got a speed loader. Neat. Cool. That's cool. Leon S. Kennedy. Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Uh, what else we got here then? Oh, this is the place we were we walked past, isn't it? Who <laughs> blurred? Was that you, sir? Did someone blur in an office? Wait, is this guy also dead? Yeah, he dead. Okay. Do I actually need to come back in here? Just wondering if I can draw this guy out. Well, don't come whinging to me about it, weirdo. Alright. Hey, I'm just gonna go check in your office a sec. Is there anything good in here? Oh, well, this didn't work, did it? Come on, Claire. Okay, there we go. Right. There's a safe, of which we do not have a combination. So we need there's two safes we've now found. And that's it. Alright, let's You know what? Oh actually I was gonna say I don't need to shoot you, but I think just in case I come back, because there's a safe in here, I'll make sure we finish this guy off. Ah fuck. Every wasted shot is a shame. Oh, come on, dude. There we go. Man, that guy did not want to die. Okay, well, what's up here? Oh. Okay. But that leads to the main hall. There's. Oh, good, it actually marks stuff on there with an exclamation mark of stuff I need. Cool. Well. Otherwise, we've actually explored quite well. What I'm probably going to do is stop here for today. I'm going to go back and go save it, probably, on the thing. We'll carry on from here next time. Assuming there's no zombies on the way back. Cool. Oh, can we even get back the way we came? I just realised that might not even be an option. No, that's not even an option. Never mind. Scratch that then. we got to keep going. Sir? If you break for that window, sir, I'm going to be very disappointed in you. More importantly, more boards. Yoink. Ah. Uh, yoink. Ew, funky. 
Ah, here we go. We'll stop here for today, then. The Dark Room. We'll explore all this next time. Thank you very much for watching the first set of Resident Evil 2 Remake, or whatever the hell I'm going to call this eventually. From me and from Claire, thank you for watching. I'll see you all next time, alright? It's been a blast. Any suggestions? Not loud enough, not bright enough, too bright, etc, etc. Do let me know, because I can change things. It is recorded literally before I upload it. You know, I don't do this on mass. So let me know, changes will happen. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Peace.